What the hell just did happen there, Christian? Yeah, I, to be honest, I have no idea. Like, uh, the legs was pretty good on the bike, so I, pretty good. Yeah, pretty, <laughs> really good. I, I've never held that high of average power for the first hour, and I, I caught the front, and then tried to search a bit to break up all the groups, and in the end, I. I got away from Custis and Svensson, and uh, yeah, then Svensson uh, bridged the gap up to me again, and then we had kind of a bit of a teamwork. So that was uh, really nice, and also helped me, yeah, being honest and not fade too much, because I really paid for the first hour and really had to be patient to try and get myself back. And then, you know, it was a bit of a chance on the run because. When you bike that hard, and we both bike pretty hard, so uh, uh, you never know how the legs are gonna feel. But was this the best race of your life? Yeah, I've never, never had such good energy throughout the marathon. Like that was crazy. Yeah. About the start of the marathon, you you started uh, together with uh, Jesper, of course, and I saw you running together side by side, about three laps, uh, talking, laughing. What, what what were you talking about? Yeah, so we were talking a bit of everything about his mom and dad and what we were going to race next. Really? Yeah, yeah. So it was kind of nice. I think the first two laps kind of just went by because we were small talking. But how is that possible when you go that fast? Yeah, we, we agreed that if we were a bit conservative, we thought that the others wasn't going to catch us anytime soon and then maybe we could increase and then... Like, it wasn't even on purpose, but on the third lap, I started running a bit fast and then I kind of had to commit. And then I really felt it and I had to, I, I got a little gap, but then he put me back and I thought, this is, yeah, this is not, this is not good, but the, at, at the end the elastic band snapped and it's a good tick. How does it feel when uh, you came here in 2019, becoming second, now your first world championship? What's that, what's that feeling about? Yeah, surreal to be honest because I came fourth, third, second and then it's just something I tell myself, oh, then I have to be first, right? But there's like 20 other guys who want to be first as well, so yeah, but it was, yeah, one of the, or the best day in my career so far, so. Congratulations so much. Thank you very much.